have ever dreamed on your 20th birthday. Loyalty can be demonstrated only in adversity. Think about that. Think about what that teaches. It teaches you that you have no way out. And no matter what they do, loyalty will shine through in adversity. How messed up is that? Be loyal to God, be loyal to your parents and that authority, and be willing to love your spouse even when it hurts. Do you have any comments, Anna? Do you think 12 years is fair, Anna? This comes up with Anna Duggar a lot. Why can't she just leave? Well, just let's take a look at why she just can't leave. Okay, so she was raised without an education. She was chosen for Joshua Duggar. Her duty is to him to be pleasing in every way, always, even if he's not there. She has a bevy of children with him. We all out here know that somebody like that would find resources. She'd have a book deal so fast, but she doesn't know that. She probably doesn't know the truth of her situation. Josh was my first love. He's my one and only. My only hope was to cling to my faith because I think in the stun and in the shock of everything, I was just praying God help, help me to know how to respond to all of this. Young, idealistic people can get tangled up in that stuff all of the time, as I know firsthand. And in here is Tia doing dishes again. And fundamentalism, suffering means holiness. So I was just tapping into that narrative of, you're too happy, something's wrong. In October of 2007, my husband followed me around the house for four hours with a length of firewood, promising to bludgeon me to death. And then out of the blue, he goes, I'm out of here. And I heard a voice in my head that said, run, right now. So I went and got the kids, I put them in the car, and he had gone back to his office to get his gun. And if I had stayed home, we would be dead. I escaped by the skin of my teeth. So I'm never gonna say it's easy. 